eight uh, former Navy personnel in Qatar were given death sentence uh, by a Qatar court and now uh, a Qatar court has accepted uh, the appeal against the order and sources have told NDTV that the appeal could be heard soon. Remember these are eight former Indian Navy personnel we are talking about who were given death sentence um, in Qatar. Of course, they had led warships for India earlier. Uh, they were working at a private firm. But now the big development in this is that Qatar has accepted the appeal against uh, the death sentence of eight Indian sailors. Of course, it's important uh, given the fact that India had also said earlier, in fact, the Minister of External Affairs had said that it will continue to provide consular assistance uh, to Indians there and uh, will appeal the order as well. Of course, there are multiple legal options that India, India was looking at, of course, appealing at a higher court uh, or the appeal court in Qatar, also invoking international law in this. But finally, now Qatar has accepted, remains to be seen how this pans out because remember, it was an extremely controversial case and eight uh, Indian Navy personnel, ex-Indian Navy personnel were given death sentence by Qatar. Um, India, of course, uh, said that it was shocked at this order earlier. This is what uh, the Ministry of External Affairs had said and it had also said that it will appeal the order as well. And finally, Qatar has accepted. What were the legal options that India was looking at? Well, India was looking at, as I said, appealing uh, at a higher court. Well, of course, Qatar has an appeal court uh, as well. India was also looking at uh, invoking international law, invoking you know the various international conventions that are there uh, in this as well. Of course, multiple countries have banned uh, death sentence and have sort of shifted away from capital punishment, but Qatar. Uh, you know, giving uh, death sentence to eight uh, uh, former Navy personnel of India uh, of, from India uh, is something that uh, really shocked India. In fact, they were working for a private firm. In fact, there were allegations of espionage against them as well. Uh, there was there were really no comments as far as uh, that is concerned. In fact, India had said that they will appeal this order. Uma Shankar is now joining us uh, live on the broadcast. So, Uma, uh, Bharat ne pehle bhi kaha tha ki order ko appeal karegi hai aur unho ne kaha tha ki ye uh, consular assistance bhi provide karti rahegi. Aapke sutra kya bata rahe hain kab ye uh, hearing ho sakti hai is appeal ki? जी देखिए कल जो अपील दायर की गई है उसको वहां की कोर्ट ने जो है वो उसको मंजूर कर लिया है और अब कोर्ट जो है उस अपील को अध्ययन करेगा और जल्द ही एक सुनवाई की तारीख जो है वो निश्चित की जाएगी जो हमारे सूत्र हैं वो बताते हैं कि सुनवाई की तारीख बहुत जल्द होगी एक हफ्ते के भीतर होगी एक तारीख जो है वो तीस नवम्बर की निकल कर सामने आ रही है लेकिन इस बात का कन्फर्मेशन अभी नहीं है कि तीस नवंबर को ही क्या है वो सुनवाई होगी भारत के पास अपील के दो मौके हैं इन आठों भारतीयों के लिए ये पहला अपील है जिसको कि स्वीकार किया गया है और इसके बाद इस अपील के ऊपर कोर्ट का फैसला क्या आता है उसको देखने के बाद फिर से एक दूसरा अपील भी फाइल की आ, आ, दायर किया जा सकता है अगर पहले अपील में मदद नहीं मिलती है सजा से आ, जो आ, राहत नहीं मिलती है उन आठों भारतीयों को तो भारत की कोशिश ये है कि जल्दी से जल्दी दोनों अपील की जो प्रक्रिया है वो पूरी हो जाए और अगर इसमें राहत नहीं मिलती है तो फिर आगे जो आ, कतर के अमीर हैं उनके पास इस मामले को लेकर जाया जाए लेकिन अभी देखना होगा कि जिन जिन आधार पर यह अपील दायर की गई है उसके ऊपर कोर्ट का क्या कहना है भारत की तरफ से जो जानकारी अभी तक निकल सामने आई है वो ये है कि बहुत ज्यादा सबूत इस बात के नहीं है जिस तरह से आरोप लगाए गए हालांकि आरोपों को सार्वजनिक नहीं किया गया है लेकिन इतना जरूर कहा जा रहा है कि जिस तरह के आरोप लगाए गए हैं उसके खिलाफ बहुत ज्यादा पुख्ता सबूत नहीं है और जो सबूत पेश किए गए हैं क्या वो कोर्ट में एडमिसेबल है भी है नहीं इन सब बातों पर चर्चा होगी जब अपील पर सुनवाई शुरू होगी अभी बड़ी खबर यही कि इन आठों भारतीयों को के, को के अपील को कोर्ट ने वहां पर मंजूर कर लिया है और उस पर जल्द ही सुनवाई शुरू होगी